I think probably in a community as diverse as, as ours, there's a lot of different conversations you have to have with different populations. For some people, um, I think it's a prioritization issue. Where does getting a third shot fit into their priorities of their day to day? Folks who are need to go to work, need to put food on the table, need to take care of their children. When do they have time to get a third shot? When we were doing the first two doses, we were in a very different place in this county. A lot of things weren't open um, and it was really seen as essential to getting uh, back to normal, getting those shots. And now with, with I know it may seem with mass mandates and other things, things aren't quite back to normal and, and they're not, but um, that people are back in their in their workplaces and back doing lots of things. And so they have to find time to, to make this happen. And so we're hoping that we can um, emphasize this as a priority, as an important as important as getting those first two shots were for continued immunity, um, you know, and, and share that with the with the population. Um, but we're also working to uh, reduce the, you know, the, the challenges to getting a vaccination, trying to be um, uh, fairly easy to access throughout the county. And a lot of what we've been doing with MCPS uh, in going into schools on weekends and after school and having vaccine that they're available, not just for the children, but for their parents and family members and the teachers um, is to try to, again, increase that accessibility.